Hey guys, I'm watering the plants today. This one needs some too. And this one. Oh no, it's raining. I guess the plants don't need me to water them anymore. Let's go inside. Ooh, that was close. But look, Mom made me some lunch. Wait a minute. How come we have to eat food, but the plants don't? How do they live? Mommy! What is it, Ryan? Plants make their own food, right? Yes, they do! But how? Let me explain it to you. Huh? Where'd you go? I thought you were gonna explain. Welcome to Ryan's world. Plants like this one. Hi. And this one. And even this one all makes their own food through a process called photosynthesis. Say it with me, photosynthesis. Photosynthesis. Again, photosynthesis. Photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is when green plants use light energy to make their own food. Photo means light and synthesis means put together. So photosynthesis means using light to put together to make their own food. Isn't that cool? Besides sunlight, plants also need water and a carbon dioxide gas that comes from the air. So let's recap. What are the three things plants need to survive? First, sunlight. Oh, it's so sunny today. What's number two? Water. Oh no, it's starting to rain. Oh, I think I got my umbrella. It's good for the plants. And number three, carbon dioxide gas. The same gas we use to breathe out. Plants need all three of these things to make their own food, which is called glucose. Stay with me. Glucose, which is just sugar, and they also give out oxygen, which is the gas that we need to survive. We breathe in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide. Plants are the opposite of us. They breathe in carbon dioxide and breathe out or releases oxygen. Plants breathe carbon dioxide from the air through their leaves. On the surface of the leaves are lots of tiny little pores called stomata. The carbon dioxide enters the leaves of the plants through the stomata. Plants have molecules called chlorophyll, and the chlorophyll is what absorbs in the sunlight. So, plants take in water, carbon dioxide, and it uses sunlight to make their own food. A sugar called, what is it called again? Glucose! Say it with me. Glucose. Glucose. Yeah, it releases the oxygen into the air. Do you guys notice how clean and pure the air feels when you're around plants? Plants releases oxygen into the air, and we need oxygen to survive. Thank you, plants. So together, we should do everything that we can to protect all plants around us and here on Earth. That way, we'll have plenty of oxygen for us and the animals here to survive. Okay, so now that we learned so much about photosynthesis, let's take a quiz. Question number one. How do plants make their own food? Is it A, by cooking? Or is it B, through a process called photosynthesis? Or is it C, by baking their own food? Did you get the answer right? It is B, photosynthesis. Plants use light energy to make their own food. Question number two. What are three basic things plants need to survive? Is it 
A, sunlight, pizza, and french fries? Or is it B, sunlight, water, and carbon dioxide? Or is it C, sunlight, bread, mm, and cheese? Did you get it? The answer is B. In order to survive, plants need three basic things, which is sunlight, water, and carbon dioxide. Question number three. What do plants breathe in through their stomata? Is it A, oxygen? B, perfume? Or is it Carbon dioxide. Did you get the answer? That's right, the answer is C. Carbon dioxide, yay! Now that we learned so much on how plants make their own food, photosynthesis, let's go and tell Ryan. That was a really good lunch. So, that's how plants make their own food. Yeah, through photosynthesis. Make more food. Thank you for watching. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Bye.